like every county council in the country, we're facing challenges because our funding has to stretch further than ever before. And we need to make sure value for money is at the heart of everything we do. That's why we're developing our enterprising council vision, which has been approved by Cabinet. So what does that mean? Being an enterprising council means placing value for money at the heart of everything we do and making sure that we're efficient and effective and that we're focused on getting the best results for our residents. That we do things with local pe people rather than to them and that we value fairness, openness and partnership. We're proud of Derbyshire and ambitious for our public services. So delivering 21st century services to local people uh, and the services that they want and need, we must rise to the challenge by thinking and doing things differently, by not shirking bold decisions or change, and being commercially minded in seeking the best result for every penny we spend. Already around 50% of what we do is provided by voluntary or commercial organisations, and this will undoubtedly increase in the future. We'll be looking at every service we provide and we'll be determining if there's a better model for delivery, including further commissioning and looking at sharing or trading services with other councils. And is it just about saving money? I don't think it is. It's more about modernising and changing as the world changes. We need to be open-minded and in a position to take advantage of new technology and better ways of doing things for our residents and employees. In the future, it's likely more of our staff will work for other organisations delivering public services on our behalf. You may have seen the media reports of job losses at Derbyshire County Council over the next year. Around 260 positions are expected to go, but we expect the vast majority to be met uh, by not replacing staff when they leave the authority, or early retirements or voluntary redundancy. Compulsory redundancies are always a last resort. And to put that into some kind of context, at the moment we are seeking 191 um, empl new employees. Budget reductions mean we would have to reduce staff numbers anyway. By delivering the value for money, which our enterprising council brings, it means we can keep them to a minimum. So in terms of what this means for users of our services and what happens next, we'll be working hard to ensure a seamless transition to our enterprising council model. This means service users should experience very little disruption. We will continue to be committed to delivering excellent services for Derbyshire residents. I'm excited at the opportunities for our enterprising council vision brings and I'm looking forward to developing plans for the future.